on this map to yeah. Usually we hop on this map to watch the impressive mid-air rockets, but unfortunately I don't think we're gonna get that pleasure tonight. Pitch finally needing to switch up to rockets, the only weapon that he has ammo left for, so we'll pick up a bit of uh, MG ammo. And no quad doesn't exist in the uh, 1v1 version, thankfully. I don't think it does. Right? It doesn't, does it? <laughs> no. I've actually never gotten up to yeah, one v one. You set some crazy rails for a 70 ping. Yeah. What can bad. I say? Although he's probably just used to it. So eight uh, impressives, I think. So very nice. Our next matchup shall be. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember that. But anyway, <laughs> we shall go live pitch. Getting kind of a rough spawn, but so did Vortex trying to uh, get up to uh, red armor that has yet to be taken. Mega will go to Vortex, and now he grabs red with a rail gun in hand and having done damage with it. He's in pretty good shape. This one's going to get the kill. Nice move there. Pitch will go down. So now I believe that uh, Vortex is G1 player, who we have seen, who actually has uh, claimed the crown, I think, one or two nights for King of the Hill. Nice dodge of the rocket. Look at, wow, he had to definitely thread a needle there. But he's able to get it done, pick up both power-ups, and uh, now I think Pitch is really going to have uh, one hell of a hard time getting anything back. Because one thing that we do know about G1 player is that uh, he will lock down timing. He has really crisp aim. Um, his railgun can be pretty darn scary. So um, I recall, I think that he won the crown playing on T7 against someone pretty good, like maybe maybe it's a noob or something like that. So he certainly has yeah. some skill. Look at this aggressive move. A little bit too late for the mega, and it will cost him. Pitch picks up the. Uh, Tying frag, Vortex chilling. Making sure his ping is, wow, his ping is like 63. Yeah, it did spike a little bit there. But they're both at about 70, 80 ish, so. Yeah, G1 players have played a lot of turnies lately, and um, he's made it pretty far. He's definitely an established player. If that is him, I don't. I didn't know that was him, but. All right then. Yeah, we got a lot of uh, peanut gallery stuff going on, and I will definitely start kicking people. I don't mind banter about the games or something like that, but you know, come on, let's keep it civil. Yeah. With a name like Jill Biden, I mean, what can you expect? Yeah. Nice grab of the mega and. A fade away rail will even things up a little bit here. Uh, about 110 health and armor for pitch, and about 150 um, health and 100 armor after the red pickup for Vortex. So Vortex coming back with a vengeance, trying to get uh, that very precious lead. Currently seeing at one to one though. Um, control still remains in Vortex's hands. Or at least the advantage. I don't know if I would say control at this point. A lot of uh, a lot of other casters they throw around the word control. I don't I don't really like to say one pickup of an item is control of it. I would say maybe two consecutive cycles and being there on time. That's control. Yeah, I mean. What I saw against King with pitch playing and his timing and the way he was denying, like, like when you get to the point where you're getting all the items and you're denying weapons, that where that's where I start to say, wow, yeah, he's got control of the map. But I might say, like, you know, he has control of red armor. He got two or three pickups. But I understand what you're saying. But with 200, 200 stack right now, he's he's got control. Yeah. That's probably a good indicator. <laughs> And pitch is running about 100, 100, so... He's yeah, but waiting, see, here's the important thing, though. 
is that pitch is not putting himself in harm's way. And I really applaud players that can do that because it seems silly, but honestly, avoiding your opponent is one of the hardest things to do. It's a little bit easier on ZTN yeah. than, say, compared to T4 or even something like uh, T9 or even maybe T7, but um, still, it's it's really important, and, and if we go take a look at Pitch, he should have, yeah, he's got 200 armor now, because he's crossed the map and managed to get himself armor without taking damage. That's really important. And look at that Vortex, basically trying to spring the trap, forcing Pitch to give away his location, and he is uh, giving up a chance to get this red armor done, no damage. Vortex knows that he now has an advantage, picks up the positional advantage for this Mega, will hit a railgun come back for more he's checking he knows he can get this yellow and back and uh, it's easy peasy mega time so vortex should be able to get this frag everything is set for his favor including no damage done against him everything thrown on the pitch that was a ton of LG red will keep pitching the game though but um, still really solid uh, solid LG vortex should get this frag right here there it is. Yeah, you're right. I mean, I call it ninja abilities, but your ability to hide and, and kind of be quiet is, is like key to anyone's game, really, because even the best players lose control or um, go down on their stack. And so their ability to just kind of like find the places on the map where it's hard to chase down your opponent and um, just being able to run, you know, I guess efficiently taking routes that your opponent doesn't expect. And it's really hard to tell. But I mean, if Pitch, if Pitch wasn't a little bit better at hiding, he'd be down 5-0, I mean 5-1 or 4-1, I mean, he's really had a lower stack for a long time now. Nice big Ooh. rock is coming in from Pitch, 20 health, that'll be not wow. enough to get him to the red armor platform. Look how he comes back for more, um, I think, I think that was a bit wasteful, um... I don't know, I mean, yeah, he can get the shotgun, but like, he didn't have any good options here. I, I kind of just think he was just to put it away. And it's now 3-2. to two. Again, going yeah. back to the phenomenal work that Pitch has done staying out of harm's way when he didn't have control. And that is uh, such a great sign of uh, a solid player. Pitch should pick up this frag here. <laughs> Vortex running for Yeah, I life. mean, oh. and Vortex's uh, inability to hide at this, at this point, it, that's where those two frags came seems like, or at least the last frag there. He should have gotten the second one, but Vortex sneaked away with like 10 health or 20 health. Nice little uh, maneuver here for Vortex. He needs to get the hell out of dodge. He totally lost track of where Pitch was. I figured he was going to go through that teleporter. I kind of liked the idea of trying to do damage against Pitch when he was in the center area up top, but I don't know what he was thinking there in the mega corridor. Either way, Pitch will pick up frag number four. Yeah. Vortex now down by two, and the clock is ticking. Yeah, I mean, like you said, Pitch is doing a really good job of hiding, and Vortex just really doesn't know where to go without giving up his position. I mean, he did a great job when he had all the items, and we had somewhat of a control of the map, but... Uh, yeah, I mean, that's why you don't want to say, like, oh, just because a person has three or four megas or whatever, doesn't mean that they're really controlling the map, and you got to look at the, the score line. Uh, even without control, Pitch only gave up, like, one frag, really. Yeah. Or even without having some of the items, I mean, he was still in control. Well, what yeah, he was doing was crossing weird. the map without being detected and managing to use... He was basically using the yellows, which is the exact thing that you want to do when you don't have control of the red and mega. Um, and you keep stacking the yellows, you can get up to 150 armor pretty easily uh, just by crossing the map once. And, and um, you know, if you're careful about it, then that's enough really to fight for a mega health. And that kind of tends to be your... your your big target because obviously you've got the armor you don't need the red um, so you just look to do damage against the red pickup from below and then scoop up the mega I mean that's that's kind of the standard way to get back in on this map I think 
Nice little corner play here by Vortex, flying through pitches now down to a mere 41 health.